Morrisonville took on Oakville in the Class 1A Blackburn Sectional Championship game. Both pitchers ended the first inning with strikeouts. But the scoring started in the third when Alec Wininski doubled to score the first run. And the Rockets added another before Wilkinson got a strikeout to get out of the third inning down two to nothing. The Mohawks were able to answer back in the fourth after an Austin Dale triple as Alex Brokamp drove him in to make it 2-1. With Deal up again in the sixth, the Mohawks got a tough break after Wilkinson was called out for not tagging from second base. And I'll let Coach Montgomery share his displeasure for the call. And I, I'm, I'm going to get this off my chest because this really bugs me. It's been 2001 since an umpire inserted himself into a ball game and really made a difference. And the call he made on Brady was just a ridiculous call. It had nothing to do with anything. He just pulled it out of his back pocket. And we have a runner at third base with, with one out, my four or five hitters coming, and a chance to tie. And that turns the game over. And I, I can't even tell you how unhappy I am with that call. It's ridiculous. Now, I haven't said this. I haven't said that an umpire made a difference in a ball game in 14 years. This guy made a difference in this game. Now, we, we get one hit. That obviously we gotta do better than that. But I'm really disappointed to, to have a ball game taken out of our hands by a call that he just did. He just inserted himself in a game. He just loved to get out there and, and he just, he hurt us big time. After Morrisonville lost their momentum with the call, Mason Drury came up and doubled to bring in another run. And that brought up Brad Furrup who blasted a two-run home run to left to make it 5-1. to one. <laughs> Oakville's Brendan Killian went out to finish the game, giving up just one hit as the Rockets got the 5-1 to one win. He, the kid threw a good game. He did a good job. We didn't hit as well as we needed to. We needed to, we needed to make some contact and didn't get it. So we didn't hit well enough to win a game. Step forward to receive their sectional championship plaque from tournament director Mike Neal of Blackburn College. Congratulations to the Oakville Rockets. They will advance on to play at tomorrow's Super Sectional at Lincoln Land Community College. I mean, we had to do a lot of things well to get where we were at. So it was a great season, had a great time. Kids are phenomenal. Our fans were great. So it's a tough way to go out, but you're going to go out. It's a whole lot better than if we hadn't won the regional. What a tremendous job by these kids. We're, I mean, it's one of those things where we're not going to have Dane hanging around being silly. And, you know, we're not, we're, we're not going to put this kind of team on the field for a while again. Uh, we just got just a, a, an incredible group of seniors. Uh, you know, they were a lot of fun all the way through. And they, I think they matured to the point where they could win games um, and they competed well. I mean, right up to the end. It's a, like I say, you, you don't, you're going to lose at the end unless you win the state championship. So it, it's, it's, a, it's tough to lose, but the kids have done a great job. It's been a, it's been a really good time with these kids. You can't, you know, you couldn't ask for better kids or a better situation, and it's just been a lot of fun.